so this intro uh, that I'm recording for you right now, the one for this video got messed up, so I'm redoing it right now. So here we go. So today, my brother is going to be chopping some corn stalks with one of our New Holland tractors that is in the shed there. So I'm gonna go unhook the baler. This is the 8160. It says 8260, but it's really an 8160. Um, my dad and uncle just repainted the hood and got new sides for the hood because they were all rusted out. So my brother's gonna be running this tractor today with our Ford Batwing. So I'm just gonna leave this sit here because I don't know if we want to back the baler back in the shed and unhook it or if we want to just park it outside. So I'm just gonna leave it here for uh, until my dad gets here. All right, so I just got off the phone with dad and he wants the baler back back into the shed here so I think I'm gonna put it just right close right there You guys let me know when I'm about to hit the wall, please. I probably got two feet. That's good. Always shut the tractor off when you're going to be taking off the PTO. I should have shut it off right when I parked it. PTOs are right here, and they're very dangerous, and they've killed a lot of people, so please be careful when you're around them. That's unhooked. Let's get out of here. Since I'm going by the fuel barrel here, I'm just going to top it up quick. I got the tractor backed up to our Ford Batwing here. And there's a special hitch that has to work with this. See, my grandpa fabricated this. And last year when I chopped stocks, we had to put a different drawbar. 
so this would work. And I don't, I'm not going to wait for my dad to get here because I don't know where that's at. Okay, so this here is the thing we put on the draw bar. So this mower is able to hook up. It's something that my grandpa made years and years ago. All right, so I'm heading out to uh, Sergeant's with the tractor so my brother can chop some stocks. The tractor's been sitting for a little while, so the tires are a little square. So it's a, it's a bumpy ride for a little ways, but they straighten themselves out. Hey, the sergeant's here, um, going back to the field. And then my dad's gonna teach your brother how to run this beast. And then um, my dad's gonna take me over to where Greg is, over at Moorheads, where we're combining, so I can start running a grain cart. Made it to the field here. Now my dad's gonna show my brother how to run this. Um, chopping corn stalks. It's kind of cool because when I first learned how to do this, this is the field I started on. So I think that's kind of cool. But I think Brennan, my brother, will do a pretty good job here. Hopefully. We do this so it's easier on tillage. There's not a whole lot of trash that like you have to go through. It knocks all the stocks down. And so we're gonna disc all this. It's easier on the disc. Um, there's not a lot of stock standing here because this is where we loaded trucks. But the rest of this field he's gonna do. All right, so me and dad just went and got lunch and I'm in the field. Lance is coming down with the tractor and then I'm gonna be driving the tractor. Greg's just gonna be coming around here with the combine. And there's Mitchell and his brother. Hi. And here's Greg. Okay, so now that I'm back in my throne here, um, we can actually get some work done. I'm calling Greg right now at the combine. He's going to need to unload on me in a little bit. And then we're going to load the first truck of the day. Unloaded. I got the first load on right now. And I'm heading back to the trucks. Loading truck number one for today. Starting to load second truck. Second truck's full. Going to get another load with the cart. Well, I don't know what's going on. I haven't been told anything, but Dad took off with the pickup down there, and Greg stopped with the combine. So, and they're all doing something. I shut the tractor off. I'm waiting here. I'm just going to wait here until they call me because I don't know what's going on. But while we're sitting here waiting here, let's see what Aiden's doing. Well, Bryce, we're on our last field of beans here. And uh, on this field, there's a river right over there. And the river washed away the topsoil on this field and washed a bunch of rocks in. But thankfully, this is the last bean field for the year. So, uh, Get her done. Hanging up the cues, right? I'm quite nervous. Hanging when I lose sight. Life gets blurry and things... Well, here goes nothing. Aiden, why wouldn't you just drive your semis across that? Wouldn't it be a lot easier? Yeah, ha ha, funny. Funny. Drive our semis over it. Yeah, funny. Yeah, ha 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 ha. Yeah. Drive our semis over it. Ha 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 ha. Funny. Funny, Bryce. Funny. 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 Ha 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 ha. Aiden, I'm joking. Thanks for sending me them videos. That was pretty neat. Thanks for sharing. 
Got my third load with the car here. I'm going back to load the red truck. And that'll be the third load for the day. I'm just leaving the field here now. That's the eighth truck I loaded. And Lance is coming back with the white one right now. I'm gonna take that tractor over to Ballard, so let's go. Moving over to Ballard's right now. Made it to Ballard's. 